to have some uh, old players back uh, and to have a crew from last year uh, here because it just builds on what we had last year in terms of the culture uh, and that is um, there's, we have some tikanga, we have some custom that we follow to uh, get those new guys in. We, we did that last night, uh, obviously to be part of the Māori team, um, whakapapa or your geniality is uh, to Māori is very important and so last night was a great night uh, just to uh, welcome the new guys in and to uh, get them to tie uh, to their maori and to the Māori team. So we did that last night through the uh, process of just uh, standing and delivering your pepeha, where they're from, who their iwi is, uh, what are the important uh, things for them in terms of uh, their family. Uh, and they shared that with the, with the team last night. It was a great, great evening. Yeah, we uh, set up the room in a very specific way. Uh, we, we, that's one of our customs for the team. Uh, we call it uh, mate kāinga tahi ora kāinga rua. It means that when we, uh, that means that when one house falls down, uh, we rebuild it somewhere else, and that really takes uh, cognizance of the fact that we're going to move from here to Japan, and we want the boys to be in a familiar environment. So the room we set up with a whole lot of uh, images of uh, Māori, of this land. Uh, of their ancestors, uh, of important things within the Māori world, that they can draw strength on those things. We have words on the wall that are important uh, in terms of actually building a strong uh, spirit in the team and also uh, drawing out those important aspects of the Māori world that can help them uh, on the pitch and, and uh, in uh, coming together as a, as a united force. The Ponamu, actually the, the Ponamu uh, is something uh, we used uh, last night as to install a modi, we call it modi. We use karaki or incantation to actually uh, install a life force into that, a drawing from the land, a drawing from things from our homeland here that we may carry it inside something, a receptacle. Uh, last night was the Ponamu which we'll carry with us. Uh, the boys know the importance of that, certainly the senior boys, I'll look after that. Yeah, uh, we're still working with a, a group of uh, men who have uh, not long been uh, you know, given all and uh, some have won a championship final and others have uh, not been so lucky. But uh, So there is a, obviously a structured process around training uh, and how that takes place. Uh, a lot of this initial stage is about just getting them used to uh, patterns, maps, those sorts of things there so that they know uh, how they're going to work together, who are the people calling. Um, you know, what sort of uh, defensive patterns, all of that sort of stuff there. So uh, they're just working very slowly through uh, that sort of stuff. Yeah, so we're building gradually. Uh, obviously there's um, uh, not too much high impact stuff going on, but uh, it does require us to be uh, like in the pools, uh, in the gym. Uh, yeah, there's some weight pushing going on um, and just working through the systems of uh, how the team works uh, so that we can, uh, when we get into the high intensity stuff, uh, we've got those things locked in.